guess what? Kevin Messi just scored a date. The last time, Sam. Men on dating apps don't actually want dates. Or you. Dick! <laughs> well, Kev, be pleased to know that your favorite Only. not the point. Your roommate just scored a date. Like, actually? Yes. Huh. I'm. I'm proud. And. In order to make this the most grandest, best fall in love date possible. Oh no. Oh yes, you're helping. No, no I'm not. Yes you are. <sighs> Sam, no. You always end up taking things way too far. Besides, I don't want you to. Why isn't a nice, simple coffee enough? Kev, 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 Kev. In order to make this work, I can't find love with that grand gesture. For you. Mmm. <laughs> Fine, but you owe me. I awesome, thank God. Here's your homework, study up. Is this color coded? Okay, first of all, operation makes it seem like you have ulterior motives beyond finding love with strangers. Second, I am deeply regretting this already. Be honest, you love me. Grand gesture, huh? I have others lined up. Someone's bound to like me. Sure. And these are for you. <laughs> are these yellow carnations? <laughs> and roses. Are you serious? Uh, don't you remember our texts? I, what? I specifically told you I'm allergic to carnations. Oh, I'm sorry. I swear, sorry. all men are the same. You don't care about me until you get your little ego boost. Wow. Oh for two, you're killing it. <sighs> I'm definitely gonna get better. Yeah? Yeah. You think so? No doubt. I have no doubt it's not. Oh, really? Yeah. I don't like that. Yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. You hear that? Okay, Sam. It'll work! In this escape room, you've been kidnapped by the notorious Dr. Chemical. Use clues to escape, or else. Fuedes and Tentar, Escapar, for favor, no Rome Pass, nada. Sorry about all the, you know, horrible failures. 
No, I, I know. Obviously, no, I just meant that. It's okay. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Those are your words of encouragement? What I'm trying to say is that you don't seem like yourself. Hmm. So, I've been on a shitty date with every single, single person in the city, Kevin. Maybe that's it. But why do you want to be with anybody anyway? I don't want to be alone. But why now? Sam, you've never done this before, and now you're planning dream dates left and right. Why? Because I gave up on my crush, okay? I spent six years falling for them. And a couple days ago, I just realized I can move on. And now, What did you do? I know I said I wanted some space, but I was feeling bored, lonely. So, here we are. Ta-da! You couldn't have just, I don't know, woken me up, talked to me? No. Now, where's the fun in that? <laughs> Where are we even going? You'll see. Can I guess? No. Is it the beach? No. Are we going to the amusement park? You hate heights. Are we going to Paris? You also hate Italian food. <laughs> You're a menace. If I was anybody else, this plan wouldn't work. Well, as you can see, none of my plans worked. Yeah. What? What? Uh, do you want to turn this car around? Mm, no. Oh, good. Because we're here. It. Shut up. <laughs> so, I still feel like I've been kidnapped. But this, this is nice. Yeah. Sorry about that. Um, about everything. I guess I haven't been a good friend to you recently. It's not that big of a deal. I, but it is. I've been so shitty about everything lately. I, I'm just now coming to terms with how I feel. I'm sorry I dragged you into this. Sam, I'm not mad at you. I never was. Honestly, I like going along with whatever insane, over-the-top plan you came up with for the day. Yeah. Really? But you never told me you had a crush on someone. Yeah, I guess I have. Sorry about that. It never would have worked out the way I imagined, though. But it was a nice dream. Well, tell me about it anyway. If you had one dream date, no restrictions, you could do anything you wanted, how would you make it perfect? Well, there'd be a giant whale, for starters. <laughs> of course. Every great date has one. <laughs> there would be a box with a letter of my feelings written all there. Well, there would be this tiny, cute little dog with our names dyed in the fur. These are really concerning ideas, Sam. Look, I'm just ahead of my time, all right? Okay. But none of that matters. I've been trying to tell this one person how I felt, and still am. 
And that's why I've been putting all of my feelings into these perfect dream dates. Okay, let's revisit perfect waiting. I guess that didn't work out either, though. Why didn't you ever tell him how you felt? Because, because it changes things. Sure. I never told anybody this, but uh, I had a crush on somebody too. It was it was pretty bad. I uh, <laughs> I always imagine taking them here. Maybe we lay near the sand dunes and talk about our dreams and. Uh, Watch the clouds together. I spent six years wanting that. Still do. Do you think you could have loved me back? I do. This is nice. <laughs> we finally confess how we feel for each other, and all you have to say is, oh. <laughs> I just. <laughs> I just waited a long time for this. That makes two of us.